Hey guys, what's up? Ventus Thunder back here uh, today with what might be my first legitimate opening of a new product uh, in quite a while. And this is actually the second take on the video because the first take when I was actually opening was really, really freaking long. It's like 15 minutes or something. So this is the video that you guys are going to see first, uh, showing everything inside the container. And then the video that will be uploaded overnight will be the video showing the actual unboxing and me fumbling with the packaging and everything. So, without with further ado, with further ado, what the hell am I talking about? Without further ado, here is the box. This is the Team Plasma gift set. I'm going to do a quick little review of this, uh, this awesome set. I bought this uh, from Collector's Cash, as I usually do, because they have cheap shipping and I get free packs and stuff. And, and today's free pack was a Dragon's Exalted pack. I managed to pick myself up a Milotic Holo, so that's not bad. So yeah, I'm figuring I'm just going to use this tin as my little uh, little filming stand and when I want to show a card, because this doesn't work very well, it's really bright, just angle it down, show it like that, helps uh, get rid of most of the glare. So um, yeah, I was very psyched to get this set, it is the Team Plasma gift set, uh, and it's much more interesting, like the Japanese people, the J Japan knows how to do decks, we don't know how to do decks at all, our decks are boring as hell. They just include like a different holo version of the same card, but Japan knows how to get you to buy stuff. They include completely different cards, and sometimes they include cards like those. Which, in due time, we'll be getting to. But first, I need to show you all the other contents of this package, and there is quite a bit. So the first thing you see when you take everything out of the package is this giant uh, thing of damage counters, poison mark, burn mark. Uh, they're pretty cool, they're in a Team Plasma background, I'm not going to do anything with these, I'll just keep them sealed and probably put them back in the box later. So those are the damage counters. Uh, what is the next least awesome thing? Oh, you got this giant ass playmat. Let's see if I can uh, sort of fold this open, or un unfold it. God damn it, I'm not even going to try. But anyway, what you need to know is it looks like this, you know what a playmat looks like. And then in the middle... I guess it has like instructions in the back, and in the middle it's got this thing, so that's all you really need to know. I'll also be putting this back in the box, because I don't really need it. Let's put the things that I already talked about on the left. Alright, next up. This is a advertisement for the cards in this thing, plus other sets, and I'll show you the back side first with the other sets, trying not to unfold it too badly. Uh, so you got your little Plasma Gale cards here, Lugia, Articuno. One of each type, I guess, from Team Plasma. I really like the dark type uh, Team Plasma cards because the blue goes well with the black, and I'll be showing you an example of that soon enough. And it gives you a little ad for Plasma Gale and an ad for Spiral Force Thunder Knuckle, and who can't wait for those? Me, because I want more Team Plasma Full Art EXs because they're the best. I have all of them so far. Um, yeah, and I don't know what the hell this is. Probably telling you how to play the game. Okay. Other side. I don't know why I folded that back up, because it's still the other side to show you. This is more advertising the cards in this set. Um, there you see some of the trainers. shows that Bisharp can evolve into either Team Plasmas or Normal. I mean, Ponyard can evolve into either Team Plasmas or Normal Bisharp. And then the little, the marquee cards. And then there's, uh, I guess that says Team Plasma. Correct me if I'm wrong. And I wanted this to sort of be maybe, like, maybe the first English language video about this set. Because I'm sure there's ones in Japanese. I've personally seen one in French. That's what uh, ultimately sold me on getting this set, even though I already knew that the cards in it were completely, ridiculously awesome. So hopefully I'm either the first or one of the first to do it in English. I don't have many first on YouTube marks. Alright, next up, you got your coin. This coin is awesome. I really love it, actually. Uh, you can see the fancy pattern on this. And in a surprise move, I have another deck that will be opening for you tomorrow. And another hint about that deck is that it's not English. And I'm, I hope you guys will like it. I love my viewers. They're awesome. Uh, this is a little pin thing that I guess you put on your shirt if you want to stab yourself. I was never any good with these. I would always end up just like stabbing myself like an inch deep in the chest. So stupid. But uh, this makes a nice... Uh, I may actually decide to put this up on the background someday. It's a nice badge. Alright, we're getting closer and closer to true awesomeness. Next up, oh, I'll show that last. Next up are the sleeves. Here you guys can see the design. Darkrai 
and Giratina with the Team Plasma. And um, there's 32 sleeves. I've used six of them. I wonder what six cards those are for. The next up is the deck box. It has Team Plasma here, Team Plasma logo there, Team Plasma thing there, Pokemon card game, as if you didn't know what Giratina and Darkrai were, and it has the two marquee Pokemon on the front. And for those of you who are saying, Yo, VT, I'm tired of you showing all the other crap in this box. I know it's awesome, but you're going to show some cards already? Yeah, that's right, I am. Uh, but first, got to show you... Dang it, dang it, dang it, dang it. Got to show you the little divider they put in here. So I'm using it to divide the energy from the Pokemon. And now I shall show you the cards. Because I bought this for the cards, obviously. So first off, the, the basic energies, you get five Psychic. I do have all these in Protectors because this this little, damn it, you guys can't see that very well. Ah, you see that little PBG in the corner, that means Plasma Battle Gift, I'm assuming. But anyway, yeah, you get five basic Psychic. Yeah, this is a good way to show the cards. And five basic Dark. So nothing really barn burning. These are basic energies, but whatever. Uh, let's move on to trainers. You get one each of a lot of trainers. Well, first of all, I'll show you the two plasma energies. Team plasma energy. I think I'll get all... If I don't get all the names right, you can not sue me, because I don't speak Japanese. Plasma frigate. Team plasma grunt. You only get one each of these. I don't know how much good it does. You'd have only one each. Call rest or Akrama in Japanese, but I don't speak Japanese. Uh, Team Plasma Badge. Then you got the uh, Poison Hypnotic Machine. A lot of these were also in Plasma Gale, like this one. This is the Colrest Machine. Alright, so there are your trainers. Next up, your Pokemon. There's really not very many. You have Sableye. This is one of these. This is actually card number one of 18. You got your Yamask. There's two of these for a reason. You have two Ponyards. I do like this illustration on Ponyard. And then for some strange reason they decided to put a Dino in here, even though we don't have a Team Plasmus Hydragon. Don't get me wrong, I would love, 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 love to see a Team Plasmus Hydragon, so... Yeah, you guys, if you're watching this video, obviously listen to me and make a Team Plasmus Hydragon. I think they will eventually. I would actually like a dark type Team Plasma Side Dragon. That would be freaking awesome. Alright. Should put that in the background. Should put these in the background. Alright, next up is what you've sort of been waiting for. The most epic part of this set. So the first holo card you get is, well, in terms of importance to me, the least important holo card you get is Cofagrigus. And for some strange reason, you get two of it. I'll give you guys a little better close-up look at it. Yep. First holo Cofagrigus made, I think. Number four of 16. It's actually a pretty, pretty well-made card. All right, next up. I'm not sure how, th how well this is going to work if I just put it under the microscope immediately. That worked pretty well, actually. Uh, this is a... Getsis. Uh, he is the head honcho of Team Plasma, if you didn't know. He's Hydreigon, and the game is a dick. So that's why I think that's another reason they need to make Team Plasma's Hydreigon. If Getsis has a Hydreigon, they need to make one. And uh, this is another holo, number 13 out of 16. It's a very well done trainer. I may actually buy the Plasma Power deck for Christmas, uh, now that I've seen how awesome the Plasma trainers look. And then the last uh, normal holo card, and also my favorite of the normal holo cards, and probably my favorite Team Plasma holo overall, is Bisharp. I was really surprised that this card was um, so awesome looking. Um, I really like Bisharp as a Pokemon, and to add to that, we don't have any, we did not have any Dark type Team Plasma holo cards up until now, and uh, with the blue shield in the background and the blue back, the blue border uh, with the holo foil actually looks really really impressive for Bisharp. So that is that was definitely a plus. Alright, if you've made it through 9 minutes and 51 seconds, you'll be wanting to see the two biggest 
baddest, most awesome cards in this set. First, I'll just show you. I have put them in the sleeve, and then I double-sleeved it. So first up to show you is Giratina Full Art. I have, like, almost no words for these cards, because I obviously have to have words, otherwise I wouldn't be talking right now. Um, these, these are freaking amazing. I, I don't know. <laughs> like, you can decide for yourselves about this, but I think this looks better than Giratina EX Full Art in Japanese. And wait, if you haven't seen that yet, I'm going to get it out. Obviously didn't plan very well for this part of the video. There we go. Here's Giratina EX in Japanese, full art, dragon type. I mean, it's pretty good. It's fancy, all that stuff, but it doesn't have a blue border. And the bottom is just a little bit bland compared to this super badass crazy one that I just got in this... Uh, Plasma Power Deck. Alright, get back in your top loader. You're wasting time on the video, Garatina. God dang it. So let me give you one more look at that while it's outside of the top loader, then goes back in the top loader and back in my collection. That is an incredibly badass card. It has all the rays going on in the background. You have your HP 130, little plasma. Plasma Battle Gift thing, number two. It's just really, really badass. I can see myself making a uh, computer background out of this for sure. The good thing about double sleeving it, still fits fine in the top loader and still looks really nice. Alright, and then my absolute favorite card. He'll come out of the top loader too, just for now though. Is this Mother Blanker? No, this badass. It's really goddamn awesome. Um, when when we get this in English, I'm sure we'll, we'll all be wondering what the hell we missed out on. If they give this a treatment of the normal full arts like Reshiram and Zekrom from Black and White, I will be pissed off because America is going to be missing out on this thing. And this and Giratina are really what sold me on buying this Plasma gift set. And it's just really beautiful card. Like, you can see the collar. I guess if you can call that his collar, the red thing. Um, how they have, like, the little rays on it. The Team Plasma badge shines in the background. Yeah, it's just beautiful. All right. I think I like it even more than Darkrai EX Full Art, which I will show. It looks like this video is going to be pretty damn long anyway, but maybe this one is just better overall because I do a better job of showing stuff instead of just uh, like trying to skip over as fast as I can. Like here's the normal Darkrai EX Full Art. It's, it's really nice. It's got the gold and stuff, but I'm not sure if even this card can quite measure up to the awesomeness of my new Darkrai EX. I mean, not even an EX. It's so awesome. It's, it's a full art. It's not EX, but it's absolutely brilliant. So with that, I hope you enjoyed my uh, my Team Plasma gift set. I hope you thought all the cards were as beautiful as I did. And um, more than that, I hope you enjoy the video and its quality. Uh, do give me some feedback on this new view of the card, by the way, guys. Uh, tell me if you think it's better than it used to be, because I think it is. It shows the holo effects a lot better. So with that, that is the Team Plasma gift set. Thanks for watching, guys.